So we'll do uh, a YouTube introduction here. And uh, Austin, you go first, and then, then Janine. Oh, hey, I'm Austin Walker. You can find me at well, Austin Well, not right Walker. now. What? You said right here. <laughs> yeah, I'm going <laughs> to... I'm gonna you said introduce. Right here. I got really confused. Like, why is he just introducing himself? And he said, "Austin, go first. Well, yeah, no, I wanted to set it up, and then now I'm going to do the introduction. Okay. Are we good? <laughs> should I should I respond? I love you guys so much. Hey, everybody! <laughs> God damn it! Hey guys, I'm Austin Walker. You can find me at. <laughs> Hey everybody, my name is Jordan Mallory, and this is another installment of XCOM Enemy Unknown here on Dumb Combos, whether you are watching on Twitch or you are watching on YouTube. Thank you for joining us. Uh, joining me tonight are... Uh, hey guys, I'm Austin Walker. You can find me on Twitter at Austin underscore Walker and at ClockworkWorlds.com and uh, the Calcutech on Twitch. And? Uh, I'm Janine Hawkins. I'm Bleating Heart. On Twitter and Twitch and YouTube, and I have a website called HealerArcherMage.com where I post some stuff I do. Yeah, and you guys are going to help shepherd my ragtag crew of ne'er do well soldiers through an alien Wait. invasion. Whoa, 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 whoa! I thought you were the alien. I thought this was like, oh, humanity's fucked up. It's time for the aliens to come in. You know, the government shut down. We can. This is it. This is our time to strike. Well, that's why was... that's why they're here. We are misguided in that we think humanity is worth saving. I see. Yes. Okay. So we're okay. going to try and do Thanks that. Thanks for clearing that up. Is that why we're ne'er do wells, even though we're saving people? Yes. Exactly. But okay. we we are unknowingly ne'er do wells. That's the. Did you guys see this this XCOM Enemy Within stuff? They we talked about this last time we played a little bit, and we kind of were guessing at what the new strategy level content would be. Mm -hmm. um, did you guys see the trailer for Enemy Unknown, which or Enemy Within, which comes out next month? I did not. Me so neither. the premise the premise is there's this group called X Alt. It's 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 Exalt. It's E X A L T. I really wish it was just X A L T mm -hmm. to go like like an alternative XCOM. Um, I wish it was X B L T. BLT. I like, yeah, BLT, like, I, like Tekken Cross BLT. Got it. Hey, hey, real quick, uh, uh, is there anything we need to do before I start scanning for aliens? Probably. We've I got know, we scientists. Of, we did working, a bunch of. Right, yeah, scientists I think working we on the arc door. Doing... Alien containment is being built. We've got them building us right. a satellite, but that's going to take 20 days. So right. let's, let's scan for some stuff. Let's just let's move on. You should yeah. you should probably water your turnips and then you should make some sashimi and then you have to give that to Dillis. Yeah. Fuck Dillis. I don't care about Dillis <laughs> at all. You know, make some fried eggs and give them the forte. That's what you gotta do. Oh, Arc Thrower's done. Nice. We've completed nice our research done. into the Arc Thrower prototype, and we believe this device is ready for final production in engineering. The mechanism functions on the basic <coughs> <laughs> How you doing? <coughs> get that, maybe you should go get that wine. Maybe you should go get that. that no, I've, I've got some iced tea. I'm not gonna read this whole thing. Uh, we've got yeah. the arc thrower, which is gonna let us, um, or we can now manufacture the arc thrower, which is going to let us capture an alien alive. So I need yeah. to tell the scientists. By lady throwing to arcs at it. This. Yes. <laughs> right. Choose research. None of these are the uh, arc thrower. No, 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 you know. So now we build the arc thrower in the workshop. Right, right. Okay. So what should our research be now? I don't know. I think our like weapon fragments. I think is how you end up getting laser weapons. Okay. Laser weapons are um, good. Laser weapons are good. Like the sooner we get off of bullets, the better, in my experience. Right. So let's do that. I agree. That does seem to be the most pressing um, of our current research options. We'll begin immediately. I will notify you when a complete report. Magne points out that we did not say to like, comment, subscribe. Oh yeah. So we're fucking it up. Like, comment, subscribe, share, retweet, uh, reblog, uh, dig, dig, dig yeah, poke, dig. Uh, uh, friendster jab. Uh, is that what you Cloud? Friendster? Cloud? I don't know. I've never used friendster. Janine, I thought 
you just said, is that a thing? But because my internet isn't the best, I thought you just said fisting. And I was like, whoa, <laughs> is that, is the Friendster jab actually called fisting? <laughs> that was fisting? what you did on That's... Friendster, yeah. So, you, have to yeah. have, you have to have the, the letters match up. Should the we, Fs, right. yeah, the Fs. Should the we have right. them uh, pause on the satellite and build the arc thrower, or wait until after the satellite is built to build the arc thrower? Because yeah, the satellite is 20 days out. It's up to you. Um, I think we have to have that. Uh, what's what's the date? Where are we at in, in? How far away is our is the end of the month? That's the question. Uh, it is March sixteenth. So. So we only weeks. have. So we're gonna miss the end of this month with the satellite, no matter what. Right. The council report is in sixteen days. Yeah. So then, fuck it. Just build the arc thrower now, because right. if we could get those satellites up before the council report, mm-hmm. then they would help. Um, but we're not gonna. So, who cares? Right. Hey, Scratty. Um, Scratty B is living a schedule that makes the busted-ass schedule that Janine and I live on look amateurish. Scratty B just woke up at 11 p.m., guys. Wow. Scratty, what are you doing? He's committed. He's committed to this being up all night. At this point, I think moving to Japan would be easier than fixing that sleep schedule. Oh, he was awake for 30 hours previously, he says. Oh, never mind. That's the other thing with the satellite is we actually still need time to build out another satellite center, another uplink uh, center. So it says no current prod. Oh god, I'm so stupid. <sighs> what happened? Oh, did you do? It just they just you... made it, and I thought they were going to need time to make it, so I canceled the satellite. Uh oh. So now we have did to start over back? with the fucking satellite. Mm-hmm. Man, I don't from, know. From... No, I don't think I did. Do you, do you, say oh, and, no, he's playing Iron Man. I don't know that he can. All right. Yeah, I can't go back. Um, man. Which money do we have? What's our money? We've got 168 simoleons. Fuck. And a satellite costs you know, 100. I think those scientists would be like, um, hey, Mr. Director of this, whatever. Hey, we already have this. Why are you can't? Okay, I guess we'll just burn it. <laughs> like, I think they'd say something. Did they just throw um, it down a well? Where'd it go? Oh lord. Okay, oh. so we're gonna coffee table now. Do, are we gonna need money for anything else for the rest of the week? For the rest of the month? We are, but we'll get. We'll no, the satellite is super important. Okay. Getting satellites up. Is, that said, wait, wait, wait. Maybe we should. Maybe we should wait to see what the next mission is. If we can get like forty credits from the next mission. We could build two satellites instead of one. That's true. Okay. And then let's do that. and that would do so let's just hold off for now. We're already not gonna make this first council meeting with these satellites. As long as we make the next one we right. should be okay. The uh, alien containment chamber is now up and running. So we've got That's somewhere true. to put the alien that we catch. Alien containment facility online. So now I can assign them a new thing, but we don't have money for that if we're going to save for satellites. So let's go try and find some dudes to shoot. Sounds Oh, our weapons fragment research is done. Nice. Although the alien weapon fragments provide a limited glimpse into the systems utilized in their equipment, we've seen enough to confirm my worst suspicions about their technology, that it is vastly superior to our own. However, I have been encouraged by the rapid developments the research team has made in studying the damaged circuitry and electronics we've recovered. Our initial report, our initial efforts have already yielded a successful outcome. The new integrated sighting module created for our weaponry was heavily influenced by the alien's own targeting system. So now we can make scopes. Yeah, we should do that immediately. I take it back. We should do that. Make a scope. Um, we need a, we need one at least for our sniper. Okay. Um, I know some people snipers. will heavy we, 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 We're going to end up with a bunch of snipers, but in this early game, it's a pain in the ass, but long. like, pass that scope back and forth. Right. Mm-hmm. Uh, I made two of them. All right, well, we only have two. And so, um, so we're going to probably have another, yeah. I'll give one to Gwen Stacy. Yep. All right, and Ali Aris. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And, okay, so who should we give the arc thrower to? Probably the support, since he'll have med kits and we'll be able to... Or the assault, because he can run and gun. I think the assault. The assault with run and gun. Franco yeah. Franco. <laughs> I 
All right. Now we're ready to go kill aliens. Commander. Sounds good. The council is requesting our presence in the situation room. Here we go. Let's see how they think we did. Oh, no, this is a, a mission. Reports indicate right, right, right. A, a UN official and his associates were caught in the middle of an alien attack in Japan. If this official is killed or abducted by the aliens, it would undoubtedly spread panic and reduce the effectiveness of XCOM. We need a squad of your soldiers to escort the target safely to the extraction point. 213 simoleons, panic reduction, and a new heavy sergeant. That'd be really good. All that, that is good things we want. Let's send our best people for this. We've um, and right, this is the first time that we can bring in five people. Right. We got that upgrade last time. So we've got uh, Franco Franco. We've got Gwyno Stacy. We've got uh, Luis Guzman. We've got you mean Basili Nuke Guzman? Yes. You mean Nuke Guzman? Nuke Guzman. We've got Vasilius <laughs> Constantine, and we've got Oli Aris. So uh, I don't know about you guys, but I feel pretty good about killing these aliens right now. Let's go for it. Um, and that, that current objective in the top left, Capture a Live a Alien. I almost said Capture a Live Aryan, which is a different game that's <laughs> not this game. Yeah, Wolfenstein comes um, out next year. Dropship has arrived. Right. Uh, it is kind of like a, a soft objective. It's not a thing that you have to do in this mission in order for it to be a success. It's just an ongoing kind of meta right. meta story, meta level um, objective. Operation Christmas Hydra. <laughs> so good that hydra who knows i don't know where how many heads does it have it's a mystery now i was in I tokyo very cool. recently so i should be able to uh strategically know where all of the vending machines will be in this mission you and official peter <laughs> right go get some alien poutine mm -hmm. but i bet if you get the poutine for the aliens they will decide that earth is a friendly place and they should lay off a bit feeding the canadians local food to calm them down is the most canadian solution to to this problem. You just called so. the aliens Canadians instead of aliens. What did I say? <laughs> feeding the Canadians. Yeah, well, listen. <laughs> I've had a rough few years up here. You guys feel like <laughs> aliens to me sometimes. <laughs> okay, how does running gun work? I forget. You run um, running gun, gun, you activate it first, I think. Do you activate it first, or do you do it after you started to move? Enables you to fire, but not use items after dashing. Okay, so after dashing. But is it an ability you use, or is it a? It's just a passive. It's an ability, but you use it after. Stepping off. Got you. I think maybe. There's a team here to get Van Dorn, right? You ran up ahead. And we'll find out. Find out. Right? Oh, freaks at the bridge. Look, we're in no shame oh. to take those things out. Oh. Friendly's down at the bridge. Grab Van Dorn. We'll get you back to your aircraft. So this looks like Tokyo, right? This is how Tokyo. Yeah, exactly. Uh, all these huge American vehicles all yep. over Tokyo. This is also how wide all that, of their streets are. They're having that American car show mm -hmm. in the middle of... Uh, and they were just transporting all the big American cars there. When the aliens attacked, it was... Uh, who could have guessed it? Just bad timing. Understood. Moving out. Um, da dashing yeah. everybody way up. I risky. am hella impatient. Understood. Moving out. Impatience think, is I a virtue oh. in XCOM. Nope, no, it's the other thing. The other thing is the thing that's a virtue. Wait, what? Patience. Patience is a virtue in XCOM. I don't know. We will see. And they will yes. know us yep. by the trail of dead. Yes, our, de our people will be dead. <laughs> There will be a trail of them. Heading out. Enemy spotted. Oh, there they are. Uh, so yeah. Thin so men. The new, thin men. The new expansion is bringing in a new faction called the Exal, who are humans who think that, who kind of get what the aliens are doing and are pro-alien. Uh, I want to use the alien technology to kind of make a power grab. They've been waiting... Uh, for Th years and years for an opportunity. Oh man, did you just crit that guy? Yeah, thin man down. Yeah! Nice. Um, but they've been waiting for an opportunity to make a power grab, and the, the new alien tech is like letting them do that. And so there are now like exalt cells around the world at different locations, mm -hmm. and there's a whole new system in place for 
locating those cells, ferreting them out, and eventually going after their HQ. Um, and there's all sorts of cool things, like you can accuse a country of harboring that eight, that HQ, and if yeah. you're right, then you can go in and get them. But if you're wrong, they leave the Security Council. They leave the the XCOM Council. Like, That's awesome. So having this extra layer on top of the traditional alien layer, the, the aliens don't go away, right? Like the big picture is still we have to go go and get the aliens. Mm-hmm. But the kind of plan is that this exalt stuff kind of uh, adds a lot to the mid game, where right now there's kind of this period where you're just kind of coast in XCOM, um, and adding this. I think we'll we'll make that that whole middle section be a lot more interesting. So, do you think that means the council is going to be legit, or do you think that that or the the creepy shadowy dudes who tell you what to do, whatever I, they're called? I've um, seen cutscenes of dudes in sweaters getting punched. That's all I'm saying. Janine's like, finally. <laughs> Punch finally, the sweater guy punching Sim. I've been waiting my entire life for. You cannot use the arc thrower after run and gun. Oh, that's good to know. Thing. Yeah, Scratty B said, I don't know if run and gun lets you use the arc thrower, and I looked into it, and you can't, because the arc thrower is an item, not a weapon. I see. Mm-hmm. Um, the good news, though, is there will still be cases God, where moving. having it on the person who can run and gun makes sense, mm-hmm. where you can run them up to cover, sh- shoot one of the guys, and the next turn arc throw the other one. Right. So. Get down here! Not fair if I have all the fun. Civil Twilight says, pa- "Patience are a virtue in the XCOM infirmary." <laughs> <laughs> I permitted. Enemy in sight. Oh, got some grays. I like the little Set. piano trill that plays every time you see one of those dudes. <laughs> oh man, he moves Set. into cover. I can't see him. He says the first time he read the general's name. You're trying to rescue this general. Mm-hmm. Uh, you read it as General Von Doom. Yep. Which or General Van Doom? <laughs> that would be better. That would be ideal. That would be the best thing. I would play a m- turn-based Marvel squad strategy oh, that'd game. Be really cool. That would be super cool. Um, I missed the sectoid on an 85% shot. This is what I'm talking about. There's going to be a lot of that, I think. It's tough. XCOM is rough like that. Yeah, it's a hard game. Um, Gwen is not in a good spot for her skill set. So I'm going to dash her up. Target confirmed. Yeah, just... yeah. Holly, however, might she be able shot? to do some good. She I does... think you mean I'll... Ollie. She does have a shot. 85%. Headshot. Nice. And it's nice. a crit. Dead guy. Man, snipers are so good in this game. Yeah, they are. Snipers are good in games. Like, like man. We've had this talk, right? The mm-hmm. Always a sniper. Mm-hmm. Alright, aliens are doing stuff. Von Doom is chilling down, down there. there. You don't have control over that guy, right? He's just an NPC. Right. Um, I can almost dash to where he is. That was kind of that was weird. Rolling up. Yeah, let's get down there. Oh, alien on the ridge. See if Gwen might have a shot, but she doesn't right now. Neither does Holly, so I gotta move them up. Aye, aye, Commander. Pistol Overwatch for snipers is so frustrating. Why is that? Just a range thing, you mean? Do what? Or the fact that you have to go into it. The fact that I have to put them on Overwatch with a pistol after I move them until they get that talent is annoying. It's kind of silly. Well, it's a balance thing, right? Like, they don't let you move and shoot with the sniper rifle on the same turn to to begin with either. Because it's just too good. Two more aliens. 
plus the moment that you can move and shoot with the sniper rifle or can go into overwatch with it after moving, mm -hmm. you feel so powerful. Yeah. You really do. Objectives updated. Or, oh, or once you get squad sight, I don't know how you spec your snipers when you played this before, but I don't know what outfit squad sight is the thing that lets your sniper you like shoot at any target that your squad can see mm -hmm. and that they can make a straight line to, um, even if it's out of your sniper's visual range. And being able to just like keep a sniper at the beginning of the level, basically, especially a long, narrow one like this. Oh, yes. And just snipe across the entire level. Yeah, it's is great. It's great. Then, it is then they're great. in Overwatch all the time because they're not moving ever. Mm -hmm. So. So yeah, one of the other new things that's, that they're adding uh, is so the way you take out these exalt um, cells is by infiltrating them with a unit who goes in. Speaking of pistols, like undercover with only a pistol. Oh, that sounds cool. Um, Are and you then playing maybe, that out, or is that like just a? I, I'm not. I'm not sure. Is the demo that I saw had uh, the man in the rear? That's right, you can just drop those guys. Oh, but th he got overwatched oh, so bad. hard. He got, oh, that's the worst. he got blown up. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay, I thought you meant he went into Overwatch and got your guys. No, you crushed him. Awesome. No, he went into Overwatch and it was a mistake on his part. He should have not been there. Yeah, they're not the smartest guys. No. You know? They have to spend a lot of their, their mental energy uh, keeping their gross skin flaps over their face. Rocket, go! You may want to instruct your men to exercise restraints when using explosives. Nice. While certainly effective at killing Rockets aliens, pretty cool. they also destroy the artifacts we're hoping to recover from the Dr. Valen is telling me that using explosives can destroy the artifacts that we're recovering. Oh, um, that's correct. Um, but there are situations where it's like, who cares? Uh, yeah, I needed to get rid of those three guys. So everybody's going on Overwatch. Have you had any opportunities yet to uh, move in close and get, get an arc thrower shot in? Uh, I forgot. So no. So yes, <laughs> I had the opportunities and I wasted them. Right. Um, Mog Mog Knight says rocket yeah. punch. Uh, another new thing they're adding is rocket punching. <laughs> I'm not kidding. The Wait, giant really? Robots have a, yeah, have a rocket punch. So there's giant robots now. Right? Are there? I told you about that. Yeah, they're mechs. They're you not giant, but they're they're like three. They're like the size of two or three dudes. Oh, okay. So uh, we're talking like Exo Squad, not like Exo Squad, Bigo. right? Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Um, exactly. But still, they have a rocket punch. So there's that. That's pretty great. So this is going to be the best thing. Okay, there are alien noises, but I don't see them anywhere. Let me just bounce. There's alien music. Is there a large novelty birthday cake somewhere? Yes. They might be hiding in that. Wearing a sexy bathing suit. Okay. You gotta watch out. Heading to that location. Happy birthday, Mr. Sweater. Gonna reload. Gonna move Gwen up some. Man, the cover in this level is not ideal for the path that we have to take. It's almost like oh, they did that really. on purpose. Almost. That was a big, um, not a big Solid complaint, copy, but you know when fans of a series get pissed off at um, everything. Moving to position. At everything, <laughs> whenever anything changes. But you know, all the maps in this are crafted. Um, you know, they might still have tile sets, but they're crafted from tile sets. Mm -hmm. Whereas in the original XCOM, more for my people. I lost some there was uh, it was it was randomly generated based on tile sets. Really? And a lot. Of, yep. Yep. The original XCOM had a procedurally generated That's level perfect. system, um, and so it was just tiles, you know, placed one next to another. So you, you would recognize, oh, this is that tile from such and such. But it would give, you know, Enemy you'd have an attack in Houston, and location. that attack wouldn't just be city map 12 it would be mm -hmm. that map generated and so 
you ended up getting kind of some really evocative feeling places. Um, hey, Bio. So I, I know that I understand why people were, you know, as a big stand for procedurally generated maps in games. I get why you'd like that, Let's but these ones, the benefit of handcrafting something is you get to do things like screw with people's cover during a retreat segment. Right. You know? And you can make them really look like the area they're in, like this one, which totally looks like Tokyo. This is Tokyo, right? Well, that's the problem, right? Like, that's the other that's part of the problem is Miss. they didn't say, oh, this is the Tokyo map. They just, this is still just city map 12. Right. Yeah. Cool, randomly a selection and assigned to mission three or whatever, but... Should I try and arc throw this thin man? Can you get to him? How close do I need to be? It's real. It's it's a few steps, if I remember right. Um, I'll look at right. I can't remember which one of my dudes has the arc thrower. It's your assault, which is Franco Franco, I think. Yeah, it was Franco um, Franco. It's, it's two squares, and it, the success chance is based on their health, like Pokemon. This is Pokemon. Oh, it's like Pokemon. Um, yeah, do you see the do you see the blue the blue yes, circle around okay. him? That's the range. So yeah, if you can get him up to that spot, I think you can try to hit him with the arc on the next turn. looking bad out there. I might not have made it if you um, And then just make sure you get that one dude into cover, into full cover. Yeah. This turn. Or like, even just hunker down people, you know? Right. Everybody in the club's hunkering down. Do you know what Thin Man types are weak against? Fire types, I'm pretty sure. Oh no. Hmm. No! He killed, uh, Ollie! No. Aww. You you have a med kit. You can res her. Damn it. Can I? No, gross. And How do I do that? If she's not if she's not blood out, you should be able to. Oh, unless that's a thing you have to. No, it was a crit, man. She's like dead, oh, dead. No. <laughs> it's they bleed out when she's they're at like dead. one health. She's super dead. Oh Yikes. no, Ollie. Oh, I hope it was worth it. Get that fucking arc thrower on that dude right now. It says no targets available for the arc thrower. And get close, get close, get a little bit closer to him. You can, you can clear that. <sighs> I... Oh no way! You're gonna be still be one off. No, you got this. You got this. Get, get. It's no, dashing dash. though. There's no, no, no way to get closer one. with that dashing. Fuck! I'm just gonna have another mm. shot. That way over to the right doesn't count. Nope. Well, it counts, but it's red. Like, it's, like, red like I can't move right, there. Right, I'll, I'll just shoot you immediately. Yeah. You, know, you could move there, you just won't have... Cover. You just won't have cover. Right. Fuck, what do I do? Is it worth capturing this guy alive and torturing him? Um... I kind of want him to just die Bio because says he killed move, Holly. Bio says move to the red. Bio says you have the shot from the red. At least I think that's what he means. All yeah, right, Scratty well. says take just take the red cover and, and arc him. Oh, I can arc right, him this he... turn. Okay, yeah. Right, that's that's yeah, because that was still in your. All right, you son of a bitch. Targeting capacitated. Seventy percent. Yeah. Cross your fingers. Nice. Nice. Let's go torture this sentient being. Well, he <laughs> deserves it. Oh, Ollie. Ollie Aris. She was so she young. Was my favorite. She was she was my favorite. Now she's dead. Well, you know, you can you can just get a dude recruit and rename him like Ollie Harris, but without the apostrophe. Right. Without his name, just Ollie. Right. <laughs> she was gonna be my wife with you guys. Mm. Everybody's on Overwatch until I can get Von Doom up here. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll get that sergeant out of this, right? Yeah, I... sure. That's a replacement. Just gonna start thinking, you know, really pragmatically. <laughs> I hope you were worth it, Von Doom. 
I owe you one. Seriously. I wouldn't be here without your help. Yeah, well, Holly isn't here. Buckle up and return to base. <laughs>